By the way, the uh, noise you hear in the background, or did, was the uh, race cars, because we're at Morosa Motorsports Park, and they do have a road course on the inside. But uh, we're getting ready to start our first attempt at this rocket, and uh, something my gut tells me it's not going to go right. All ready for launch. Who hired you? <laughs> this is what our budget can support, I guess. Your crawler doesn't sound good. What? She's Alan? Well, what we're doing is we're actually coming out to Moroso's field here next to the motocross track, and we're going to actually attempt to launch our Saturn V we built. It is a model. Actually, we had somebody build it for us because we ran out of time. Uh, it's got one solid rocket engine that is very similar to what you see mounted on each side of the space shuttle's main fuel tank. Once you light them, they're lit and they're go. So I really don't know what's going to happen, but we're certainly going to attempt this, aren't we? Yep. Please, sometime today would be nice. Well, you know. You know what happens. It's only been like five hours now. It's a major production. Okay, uh, I think we're, are we up? Are we up to the launch there? Uh, what are you doing there, crawler driver? Are we there? Launch vehicle has uh, reached launch time. Kind of an abrupt stop there, but we're good with it. We're good with it. April, you need to pick your spot. Pick the sweet spot. Ow, 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 ow. ow. <laughs> Ants! That is not the Are you okay? Yeah. All right, pick our spot. Well, as far as experience in these things goes, I am your guy. Right there? X marks the spot. You like it there? Oh, you know! I am a professional rocket uh, launcher. I've been doing this for the past uh, 12 years. Launch angle rocket and I'll install the engine. Okay. All we have to do now is just install the igniter into the rocket engine. Before we do anything, April and I are going to test the ignition system. Chasing. Why are you going to burn an igniter when we only have enough for these three engines? Because we have to see if it works first. It does work. That little light on there says, hey, I work. You just trust everything, don't you? I'm watching Chase put this igniter in, and I'm not really sure what's going to happen. And I'm kind of nervous. All I want to do is the countdown. What we're going to do here is, uh, in order to give you a better view at home, we're going to attach several cameras. You can see what we've already done. We have little lip lipstick cameras, as we call them, sitting right down here. And then we're going to have a couple of bigger cameras, and we're going to see one of our cameramen if they're brave enough to actually stand really close to it, which I doubt, but we'll see. A woman with a loudspeaker. This is a dangerous combination. <laughs> two X, two X lost control. T minus 10 seconds and counting. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, one! Well, um, the first launch of uh, Two Extremes uh, space program uh, ended in uh, peril uh, due to the inexperience of our <clears throat> uh, weather technicians. Let's see, how much wind do we have? Let's do it like NASA would. Did not inform us that the rocket did not have the uh, acceleration of the thrust to uh, proceed through the wind currents, causing it to take a hard right turn into the caravan's car. <laughs> the rocket seems to be in pieces. Oh, the parachute popped when it landed. <laughs> <laughs> so much for the parachute. Let's try that again, shall we? I tapped numero dos. Josephine's oh. going to have a, a chance to uh, prove himself, but uh, that's not going to go well either. Thank you. Three, two, uh, one minute. One, launch. Go. 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 It did not go. It's not working, is it? No. Who installed the igniter this time? Go check the igniter. Uh, we uh, let our inexperienced uh, co-person, uh, Josephine, press the igniter button, uh, resulting in failure of the igniter. One more time, we attempt to launch our Saturn V. T minus three, two, one! <laughs> the rocket successfully thanks to my recalibration of our space travel vehicle. We still had an issue with our parachute popping uh, technicalities, but uh, the final result was successful because all we care about is it going up, coming down is someone else's problem. Thank you.